Shalom. Mashlomcha. Beseda, manyanim. Well, here we are. It's the Russell family on the Hebrew lesson challenge. You can see that we are getting revved up about this, aren't we? Oh, yes. Are we ready for this challenge? Ken. Which Ken? Means yes. Hello? Ken. Hi. Ken. 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 Um, what is it they say when they say so-so? Um, sababa. 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 <laughs> Sababa. Oh, that's a good one. Sababa. <laughs> sababa is what you use for just about everything. You know, if it's good, <laughs> sababa. 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 If it's sort of okay, sababa. 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 In fact, sababa has so many meanings when you say it. You know, you just got to try and work out what they meant by it, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. We learned that at the car rental shop, didn't we? Sababa. Sababa. This is Joey. That's Kelev. Joey. Oh. He's a Kelev, which means dog. He's a Kelev. And he's a yeah. good dog, so he's Kelev. Dog. Ah, he's biting my hand. <laughs> Is he allowed to do got... that? Is that legal? Yeah. No, you can't <laughs> him. Oh, yeah, let's go. get back to Haifa. Yeah, before we went, we went to the iDigital shop, and they call that iDigital instead of the iMac shop. Or Apple store. Yeah, yeah it's the, the Apple only, store. The only problem is the first mall we went to, which was called what? Kirion. Kirion? Kirion. That's the first one. It sounds it's like a best, carry on, it's doesn't best, it? Yeah. It's the best. <laughs> That's what I thought it was. I thought it was like uh, Canyon. Where are you yeah, going? Yeah. Carry on. It's the best shopping mall in Haifa <laughs> for clothes. Well, for They've us. got a new American Eagle opened up yes, there. Yes, we like it. And um, mm. some other shops that we like. What's your favourite shop there? Oh, accessorized. Must accessorized. be the apron shop where she bought an apron. Oh, oh yeah. yes. Yes, the apron. We were looking the for a apron kitchen apron shop. for Hannah. No, no. She was looking for an apron. And, and they were all really rude. So we found one that said, I love pasta. And oh, of course. Loves pasta. I, I love I pasta. I love pasta. And I said, yeah, that'll do. And we stuck it in the bag. And I we, love pasta. When we, got it, it. when we bought it home, there's rude things all over it. Guess what's all over it? Little rude shaped yeah, willy pasta. It has got pasta willies all <laughs> over it. So we've got to send it back Can to the shop. Can you believe it? What's so bad about it? You're not wearing it. It's going back. Got, all right, we're going to send it back and we're going to say in Hebrew, we don't want this apron because it has rude willies all over it. That's what we're going to say. actually find a word for a willy. That's, yeah, that'll be our uh, challenge, one of our challenges. <laughs> we are here learning Hebrew, as you can see, not playing with a dog. Go away, Joey. <laughs> right, so anyway, what we're saying is we've, we've had quite an interesting time since the last broadcast, and we decided that tonight you'd get to meet Hannah. So Hi. this is Hannah. Hi. <laughs> she is a veterinarian assistant yeah. and she's enjoying uh, working with animals, going to the zoo and all different things as well. Yeah. But anyway, let, let's get back to our Hebrew experiences. The other day, Haley and Hannah had to go to Haifa <laughs> for me and uh, anytime you venture out here, you know, it's, sometimes I feel like I'm head of security. I should go everywhere with them just to make sure everything goes smooth. When these two go out to go places, you just never know what's going to happen. Well, we so. didn't come back. We went out to the mall, which is in Hi, Hebrew, Canyon. Is it Canyon. Canyon, yeah. The Grand Canyon. Canyon. No, we went no, that to means the, the Great Mall. The Grand. Great Mall is Grand we Canyon. We went to the Kirion. Yeah, in Haifa. And, and then, no, that's outside of Haifa. <coughs> yeah. Then we went to the Grand Canyon. So we um, went to two... Or like the biggest mall. So we left here at 12.30 and we got back at 9.30 at night. And the only thing they had to get was one little cable for like my monitor. Wire. But anyway, they made the day of it and they had fun. But, you know, there's something that happens when these girls go out that just drives me crazy. Now, this has happened like forever, you know, forever. We're girls. Yeah, I know. Like I, I would be in like L.A., they'd be on the East Coast of America and I'd get this phone call. And the phone call would be, help, I don't know where I am, uh, how do I get home from here? And I'm like, well, where are you? And they would name the city they were in, and I'm like, okay, what do you see around you? Well, there's a tall building. And uh, what else would they see, Hannah? I'd be like, oh, a tree. there's a tree. And then I'd hear things like, <laughs> oh, um, do you see anything else? Yes, there's a signpost. But well, what's on the signpost? Oh, we've passed it now. Uh, yeah, we've passed it now. So, you know, it'd be like this miraculous... Uh, um, it, it, it's like a, a reality TV show over the phone trying to work out GPS, how do I get home from here? 
And, you know, this is the iPhone family. <laughs> We're all equipped, you know, to do this stuff. <laughs> I, I don't think the dog should be in this. I think he's a bad dog. It's a bad <laughs> caliph. How would you say bad dog? Oh. Ken yeah. No. Lo. No. Die. Lo. <laughs> Joey, lo. He has to die. Kelev Tom. Ah. Yeah. Lo. Lo. Die. Die, die, which means stop. Not mean die. die. Not die. Well, should we start again or are we just no. going to keep... No, we're, go we're okay. Kelev Tov. Kelev Tov. Kelev Tov. Kelev Only if he's good, he's a Kelev Tov. Mm -hmm. Good dog. Good dog. Kelev Tov. The word for, like, stop is die. And die. You think you're telling the dog to die. Die. It's a bit weird, like, isn't it? At night, you're yelling, die. And you're like... Die! Are you telling the dog to die or the owners are going to complain to you? <laughs> it's quite funny, isn't it? Yeah, Walker. <laughs> die! Well, what? I don't think they say die, because they say other they things say, as well. Yeah, but they say, uh, shake it. Shake it. But if they don't, and they say die. What's shake it? Stop. Shut up, stop. Shut yeah. up or something. Yeah. So, as you can see, it's, um, it's quite a depressed week here in Israel. It's been raining again, hasn't it, non-stop? We had a hum sing, which is a hot wind that brings a dirty rain, muddy rain, that took me all day it's yesterday. It's not rain, it's yeah, just it dust. rained. Yeah, but the, the oh. dust is in the it rain. It rained for three minutes, didn't it? Yeah, it was about, well, it rained overnight and everything was covered in a mud. Oh. All the patio, all the garden furniture, the car, the windows, um, It was just everything, everything was repainted. Yeah, so we yeah. had to it wash was. everything yeah. off, but today is a clear day. And we've got beautiful weather of 70 to 80 degrees. Very cool nice breeze. day today. Yeah. It's a bit cold. <laughs> yeah. Like okay. in, well, like I the UK, think. they're all freezing. They're all like rubbing their hands together going, <laughs> They're oh, out by the radiator. freezing. Just the warmth, come on. <laughs> yeah, and we've got the windows open and the cool air is <laughs> blowing in. It's lovely. It's hard here because the signs aren't in English. Well, they are. Well, they a lot are. of them. A lot of English. What? Well, well, English Hebrew, like, well, yeah. it's, it's not very easy to follow <laughs> it, um, you know, and you've got to learn the names, like I, you know, the names are all Kyrian, Kyriat, it's... Motskin, Motskin. Yes, yeah, yeah. you know, we're learning the signs. Kyriat, Motskin. We actually Shon, made it all the way there and all the way back. Yeah, they did. Without calling... And the no! GPS. They did, but we here's... Guess what? It had the wrong settings on. The good news is this week the GPS worked for the first time, but I still got a phone call. Just to check what road I was on, the seventh, because there are a couple of ways you can go: the long way through a fuller back to Tiberias, or the short way, or the shorter short way yeah, through. Yeah. Well, it says Nazareth, but yeah. Nazareth, yeah. It's quite funny. And they're like, all new roads. They're all they're not donkey roads anymore. It's funny, they're like you're, you're going to Nazareth, not on a donkey. Yeah. It's a bit weird, isn't it? It's proper but road. You're like, going to Jerusalem, <laughs> and there's a donkey in the road. Yeah, and camels. Oh. So there's camels along camel the side van. of the road. Jericho. Camel van. That's camel. of course. <laughs> camel van. Of course. You want the funniest thing I saw when we were going to Jerusalem one time. I saw this guy with a camel, and he was sitting on the side of the road with his laptop, working on his laptop with his camel. I thought. <laughs> That's really? mental, yeah. I thought that is just mental. So anyway, one thing we wanted to do, we wanted to make sure that as you got to meet all of us and we just sort of hang out tonight, I thought what would be pretty cool is that we would actually do some Hebrew. Yeah? Yep, that's what we're okay. here for. Okay, all right. The Here's, Hebrew challenge. Okay, no one knows what it is yet, but here we go. This is what it's going to be. Days of the week. Who knows the days of the week? Hannah? Hannah? 